basic problem with any seat is it's really not good for the human body to spend a long time sitting down. When we do sit down, we end up in what most of us medics would call a kyphotic or C-shaped curve, where your spine is in a totally unnatural C-shape. What will then tend to happen is that your shoulders will start coming away from the seat and your head will be start being pulled forward. And the reason is that your head weighs a stunning 10 pounds. So the weight of a bowling ball is the heaviest single part of your body. And as that 10 pounds is all pulled forward and down, you will end up in a slump position. Now that's very poor for the neck and the shoulder and the upper back muscles, and it leads to fatigue and cramping. And very soon you'll find yourself fidgeting around, trying to push yourself back as you are do, doing to relieve that pressure. But also it's really bad for the discs of the back. The spinal discs should be nice, spongy, big bags full of fluid and nutrients. And when they're squashed down like this, they become pieces of cardboard. And that means that when you want to come out of the cab, or jump out of the cab, or undo a hook or trainer, or anything like that, you try turning and twisting with a disc that's been squashed and it's got all the nutrients out of it, and you've got a great risk of popping a disc. However much you spend on any part of your cab or your trailer, it can all be replaced. Your spinal disc can't. So the whole point of trying to change these seats that we've done with Needler is to try and get you into a more upright, natural, S-shaped curve called the Lordotic position. And in that position, the weight of the head should be transferred all the way down the spine, naturally, not coming forward, and the dish should start to fill up again with fluid and nutrients, and your muscles should be able to react. So in a moment, we're gonna pop you into this seat. 